Hi, this is Daniel Barth from MeetDanielBarth.com and also WorkWithDanielBarth.com. I want to talk about WordPress and specifically about the difference between WordPress.com and WordPress.org and the difference between self-hosting your blog and um, having it hosted through um, an actual website or whatever. And so I want to kind of talk about the pros and cons of that. And that's really the issue when you're looking at the differences between WordPress.org and WordPress.com. Now, uh, if you're thinking of starting a blog, this is a really big issue because uh, you might not understand the rules of the game depending on if you're with WordPress.com and WordPress.org and you might be struggling to see uh, which one's better. WordPress.com is free. And there may be um, a premium service through that now, I'm not sure, uh, but it, it doesn't have to be paid. It's free, and WordPress actually hosts your blog for you. Now, um, that might sound appealing to you because you don't have to worry about hosting. You don't have to worry about you know um, that independence or worry about some of, some of the glitches that might happen that might arise if you self-host your blog or whatever. But there's a price that's paid with that. There's less freedom when WordPress, um, when they host your blog. Because your content has to then meet their terms and conditions. And you might say, well, I'm not going to put anything on my blog that's going to break their terms and conditions. So I don't have to worry about that. But you might. Because they have uh, one dangerous part of their terms and conditions about not being spammy. So if you're a marketer and you write a really great article about a product or something, they might look at that and say, this is spam, this is sales pitchy, and they can actually erase your blog um, for that. And I have had that happen a lot. When I first got started with internet marketing, WordPress.com looked awesome because I didn't have to worry about hosting, I didn't have to worry about any of that, and so I loved it a lot. And they probably deleted about <laughs> about five blogs of mine before I was finally fed up. And I said, hey, I want to self-host my stuff. I want to be with WordPress.org. And so that brings me to WordPress.org. What's, what's that like? It's a little bit more work. You're self-hosting, which means you're using the WordPress platform, but you don't have to meet their terms and conditions, meaning they will not delete your blog based on content which that freedom is vital as a marketer. So if you're in internet marketing and um, you know or even if you just own any sort of business you probably will want to have a self-hosted blog because when they delete your blog they delete your blog and you are blacklisted. You cannot repost that unless if you just assume some completely other identity but they have ways of tracking and so um, so that's that's the difference. It's a little more work with self-hosting, but it's safer in the sense that your content is safe and they don't nag you because they nag with WordPress.com. But those are some of my thoughts. Um, would love to uh, talk with you about blogging if you're thinking about using that with your business. Um, would also love to talk to you about some other strategies. See if I can get some coaching, some training in your hands. Um, I love doing that. And below this video, I've got a link for you that will take you directly to uh, my personal website. And on that website, uh, you can send me a message. You can even set up an appointment with me, uh, which is really awesome. I mean, that's like a, you know, dentist offices do that. Internet marketers don't normally let you set an appointment with them. Um, but I try to make a point to um, go ahead and provide multiple ways for you to contact me because I do want to help you with your business and I want to help you out with your marketing, with some strategies, with some tactics, come up with a game plan with you, uh, just, just help you in any way that I can and I want to be a blessing to you. So I invite you to click the link below and, um, and, and learn more. Um, thank you very much for watching this video. I wish you the best and happy blogging. Take care, and I'll see you on the website below.